What is up you guys? Uh, I'm your host Sammy Hughes Reacts 1. Welcome to my channel. We are on episode 3 of One Punch Man. Um, the name of this episode is called The Obsessive Scientist. It says this Cinema and Gennos find out about the House of Evolution of Armor, Gorilla, and learn that Guinness wants Cinema for his experiment. So I think this girl should show you that Cinema is is going all out of his way to get what he wants for himself. So let's just see how the episode plays out. So we are still in season one. So let's get on with the episode reading. Really. Long ago, there existed a brilliant young scientist. Through the musings of his astonishing genius, he was able to make a number of significant contributions to human knowledge. Eventually, however, his accomplishments led him to be disillusioned with the world. Though he was constantly showered with praise for the intricacies and revolutionary creations of his mind, none of his ideas or theories ever received even the slightest bit of support from the scientific community. Rather than advancing human civilization, his goal was the artificial evolution of humans as a species. That was the only dream he had ever had. But not a single person came forward to help him achieve his vision. Damn these simple apes! Dangerous ideas. Treating me like a freak! Do these lowbrow simians really think humans have come this far by avoiding risks? Idiots who think that mankind no longer has the need to evolve have no right to call themselves scientists, let alone pass on their genes! Of course, this plan and its fruition were always for my sake. I will carry it out even if I must do it all myself. He devoted himself to research, but it was only after he turned 70 that his efforts yielded the results he'd been searching for. So he's been obsessed with... <gasps> try to create something. First, the scientist regained the prime age range of his youth. Next, he began cloning himself en masse. He named his laboratory the House of Evolution, and, with his clones, he conducted countless experiments with animals, creating new life and new species. His experiments then shifted to human subjects. This is taking too long! Uh, What's this got to do with me? You're just trying to sound cool again. Ooh. Enough jibber-jabber. Just get to the point, okay? My master is a very busy man. Summarize it all in 20 words or less. <laughs> sure. Sorry about that. So, in other words, uh, the boss man has become passionately curious about you and your body. Too bad. I'm not interested in dudes. Master, that is not what he meant. Your body surpasses normal human limitations. So he plans on using it for his research on evolution. Unless he is stopped, I am sure he will try this again. We cannot allow him a free hand. Our move should be to attack him. Sure. Let's go. Right. Huh? Now? Yeah. There's a sale on tomorrow. Can't do it then. But... Master! This doesn't sound good. Better tell the doctor. Hey, you. No! Uh, yes? I have one last question. The House of Evolution Cyborg Development. Did it begin over four years ago? How many were created? Have any of them destroyed towns in the past? Mm. I'm not really sure. But at the House of Evolution, I'm the only combat cyborg. Mm. Impossible! Oh, Our elite force, formed for the destruction. Here we go.
so they're so they're all created by him. So he wants Genos for himself. We'll start by activating all our traps from the first floor to the eighth. If we're lucky, they will take care of the intruders. I'm aware of what will happen to us should we fail. Especially to me. I did not think we would be running the whole way. How else are we going to get there? It was my assumption that you had the ability to fly. You know humans can't do that, right? It is amazing that you are never late. You are a true hero. Really? You're kidding. I hardly ever arrive on time. <coughs> we're here. This is the place we were told about. So this is the house of evolution. One, two, three, four. Looks like it's about eight stories high.
chicken below. So I'm getting on his fail. Gave him an afro. Got a nigga hair. Yeah, nigga now. Well, I've got to admit, that was pretty impressive. You kind of got my hopes up. One punch man will be back after the break. Break. Acting like a faggot. Absurd! Carnage Capito retreating! If I'd attacked him just now, he would have killed me! Who the hell is this guy? He's leaving himself wide open. Yet all of my instincts are screaming, sending out danger signals! Huh? Bastard! What are you, some kind of freak? How in the hell did you get that draw? Genius. Fine, whatever. Genius Gino and Cinema. No, it is too risky. He must not let them know his secret. First, what's important is to make sure you really stick to this intense training regimen. Wait a minute. Not modifications to do your genetic enhancement. Just training? What training? Uh, listen, Genos. You have to keep doing it. No matter how difficult it gets. It took me a full three years to get this strong. One hundred push-ups! One hundred sit-ups! And one hundred squats! We'll do. And a ten kilometer run! Do it every single day! Make sure you eat three meals daily. Just a banana in the morning is fine. Ah, oh, healthy lifestyle. Use the air conditioner in the summer or heat in the winter so you can strengthen the mind. In the beginning, you'll wish you were dead. You might start thinking, what's the harm of taking a day off? But for me, in order to be a strong hero, even if I was spitting blood, I never stopped. I tucked it out and endured the pain. 
I did squats, even when my legs felt like they couldn't move. Even when my arms started making weird clicking noises, I kept doing push-ups. A year and a half later, I started to notice a difference. I was bald, and I had become stronger. In other words, it is just a normal level. I, I have to get stronger, understand me? I cannot believe you would do this. I did not ask to study under you to hear jokes. You don't want to ask for it. Oh, set them up, okay. I just training. Yes, that's right. I want to know your, your true secret. Please reveal it. Look, Janos. You may not believe me. That's really all I did. Oh, yeah. No, don't do it. You mustn't. If you don't want to tell us that secret, so be it. Going on another rampage. I bet you are stronger than me. Not even close. Turn us into a rhino. But since you seriously pissed me off, I'm gonna annihilate you. Carnage mode. Oh, carnage mode. Okay. That looks pretty sweet. Yo, the background looks pretty sweet, though. If you really are a strong hero, then try and stop me. No way. It can't be. Man, Carnage Mode is a beast. Mastra. Damn it. I may have inadvertently made a horrible mistake. This guy's at Carnage Mode. And he said he'll be on a rampage for a whole week? Die, 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 Yeah, what up now, Doc? Who the hell is this guy? I screwed up! What is he talking about? I believe. He is upset because he is missing this. Master, the store closes at 10 o'clock p.m. That is about this show is a trip. Now. Wow, um, well, what can I say about episode three other than craziness, epicness, crazy fight scenes, and, and, um, shoot, I forgot the dude's name. Oh, Cinema, you know, he's once again the funniest character in the uh, One Punch Man series. Uh, at the end of the fight, he he's upset because he he's missing out on good sales on stores. <laughs> That's kind of funny. And another thing I found interesting is the scientist who was pretty much obsessed with uh uh Sedema, 
who only wants him for his own experiment but unfortunately he pretty much failed at attempt for him to do all that so what can I say another great episode I'm loving this series so far I'm giving this episode a 5 out of 5 I am planning on doing more reactions to um One Punch Man but I'm not going to be able to do it um, tomorrow because I have a because it's family emergency so I would like you guys to uh, uh, respect my privacy because I will do some reactions next week and hopefully I'll be able to tell you my honest thoughts on the whole One Punch Man series and maybe in the future I'll probably uh, do some other animes like uh, see what other animes that I'm planning on um, doing Sorry guys, hold on. Tokyo Go. Yeah, so I'm planning on doing some more episodes of uh, Tokyo Go. Um, right now I'm still on season one, so I have yet to catch up. But I'm planning on doing some more um, episodes. Maybe in a few months when I get a chance to do it. But, but for right now, I want to stay focused on One Punch Man because I think it's one of the most absolute fantastic series. I love the action. I love the fight scenes. And like I said, um, it's one of the best things I've ever done. So hopefully you guys enjoy my reaction. Subscribe, leave a comment down below, and the like button. I'm your host, Devin Who's Reacts 1, and I'll see you all next week.